One of my other subscribers has asked around what I use for landing gear, so I thought I'd put a very quick video together to show how I do it. Um, I'm actually copying um, the landing gear that came on the first ever quad that I bought that was actually built for me. And it's these legs on the bottom that we're going to take a closer look at. So let me just zoom in and I can kind of talk you through what we're looking at here. So these legs are actually simply standoffs with a rubber foot screwed into the bottom and then actually held into the model by a um, by a small M3 nut. Everything on these standoffs, so actually the PCB standoffs are actually three millimeters. So if you have any three millimeter screws or washers or bits and pieces, you can use it for your landing gear. So let me show you what it looks like on the one that I've made. So here we are, we're looking at the bottom of the large quad I used recently for my um, motor prop comparison video. And here they are just protecting the battery at the bottom. So again, if I zoom in, we can quickly show you what they look like. So here, again, all I've done is just drilled a three mil hole into the bottom plate, a 25 mil standoff, uh, a rubber foot, and held in place with a nylon screw. These things are nice and light. They, they're not super robust. If you put in a hard crash, they will snap off, um, but for the cost of them, they're quite cheap and cheerful. So let me show you the individual components and you can see how they're made up. So here are the four elements. The first one is the standoff. I use these size, which is actually 25 millimeters. They have a thread on one end and a hole in the other. They're actually PCB spacers. You can buy them in quick, um, big bags from our friends on eBay, black nylon washers and M3 screws. And these are the little feet that I use, um, actually more for actually effects pedals, but they fit beautifully onto the bottom. So all you do is you get a screw, pop one through the foot, screw that onto the bottom, of it and there you are, you have your leg. You just drill a hole in the top, pop it through the bottom plate, secure it with a nut and you're done. I hope that's useful for anyone else that was thinking of asking the question. Thank you for looking. Please comment and subscribe. Happy flying.